नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम सी न्यूज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम टुडे ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ मे ए बी सी टुडेज हाईलाइट सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू हाईलाइट्स आर मैंशन हियर फर्स्ट दैट हीट वेव टू सीवी रेलवे कंडीशन विच आर गोइंग ऑन ओवर पार्ट्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट एंड सेंट्रल इंडिया लाइकली टू रिड्यूस फ्रॉम टुमारो ग्रेजुअली and uh, second point is that the conditions are uh, continue to be become favorable for onset of southwest monsoon over kerala during next 24 hours and conditions are also favorable for advance of uh, monsoon over some parts of northeast india during the same period so these are two highlights and uh, abc today's uh, synoptic systems uh, so we are having uh, uh, one cyclone circulation over northwest india and uh, bandra fronts from this uh, circulation to western parts of afghanistan uh, western parts of bangladesh across uttar pradesh uh, bihar etc and there is a, a cyclone circulation which is remnant of uh, cyclone uh, cyclonic storm remal over north east assam and extends up to middle tropospheric levels and there is a trough in westerly over bihar and uh, there is a shear east west shear zone roughly uh, along uh, 8 degree north over south central india which are affecting our south central india and uh, there is a western disturbance uh, roughly over afghanistan region as a trough in lower and middle tropospheric levels so these are synoptic systems as regards uh, uh, yesterday's uh, realized uh, weather so uh, just uh, we will uh, see the temperature uh, yesterday highest temperature of the order of 50.5 degree celsius recorded over uh, churu followed by sirsa a automatic weather station in haryana 50.3 degree celsius and yesterday delhi uh, some stations uh, like mungespur najabgad etc reported uh, temperature more than 49 degree celsius and uh, uh, some other states like uttar pradesh and madhya pradesh also recorded a uh, temperature of the order of 47 to 49 degree celsius so some of the temperatures uh, we are uh, mentioned here and uh, some of the stations uh, of uh, northwest india including uh, uh, agra banaras in bihar dehri and uh, some more stations like uh, uh, jhansi etc uh, 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 recorded a uh, highest temperature uh, which was uh, uh, which has broken uh, earlier records of temperature so yesterday heat accordingly heat wave to severe heat wave conditions uh, prevailed uh, over most parts of uh, punjab haryana delhi and some parts of rajasthan uttar pradesh and madhya pradesh and heat wave conditions also prevailed over jammu kashmir and uh, himachal pradesh regions of western himal region and heat wave conditions also also prevailed over uh, vidarbha uh, region yesterday and uh, uh, on day 1 some of the stations of eastern parts of the country including bihar jharkhand and odisha also recorded uh, heat wave like situations and so accordingly heat wave conditions have been prevailed over uh, uh, more many to most parts of northwest india and uh, some parts of uh, western bihar region and some parts of central and adjoining uh, uh, maharashtra region so this is a situation of uh, yesterday's heat wave conditions and if we see uh, this uh, maximum temperature scenario uh, maximum temperature scenario we will see that uh, this uh, th- these are uh, map format uh, you will see that this whole parts of northwest india central india maharashtra region and adjoining eastern parts of the country temperatures uh, over this region of northwest india are of the order of 46 to 50 degree celsius uh, at uh, some locations and uh, 42 to 46 degree celsius over uh, many parts of central gujarat region maharashtra region adjoining eastern parts of the country and they are above normal by 3 to 6 degree celsius over this pockets of uh, northwest india uttar pradesh adjoining central and east india however because of uh, heavy rainfall activity temperatures are uh, below normal over northeast india as regards heavy rainfall activity under the influence of remnant of cyclonic storm remal heavy to very heavy rainfall uh, with isolated uh, extreme heavy rainfall reported over northeast india in meghalaya 28 cm rainfall reported and uh, heavy to very heavy rainfall also reported over south central india including uh, 20 cm over kerala and uh, uh, heavy to very heavy rainfall also reported over some island west bengal in tamil nadu uh, some moderate rainfall in arunachal pradesh again uh, heavy to very very rainfall reported so in in summary we can see that heavy to very heavy rainfall reported over arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya in adjoining regions of nagaland manipur and mizoram tripura and heavy to very heavy rainfall also reported over kerala and mahe and uh, heavy rainfall over heavy to very heavy rainfall over some island west bengal and sikkim so this is a realized weather now move to five days warning 
so you will see that uh, the ongoing spell of heat wave to severe heat wave conditions likely to continue today over Rajasthan, Punjab, Haryana, Chandigarh, Delhi, Uttar Pradesh and Madhya Pradesh and heat wave conditions likely to develop over Bihar, Jharkhand, Bihar, Jharkhand, Odisha and heat wave conditions likely to develop over Chhattisgarh and continue over Vidharva region. So this whole pockets of Rajasthan, Punjab, Haryana, Uttar Pradesh and Madhya Pradesh given red color burning, orange color is burning due to heat wave conditions given to Bihar, Jharkhand and Odisha and heavy to very heavy rainfall today likely to continue over Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Meghalaya and extremely heavy rainfall also likely over Meghalaya today and heavy rainfall over Nagaland, Manipur, Majoram, Tibra today and heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Southern and West Bengal and Sikkim. Today under the influence of western disturbance, thunderstorm activity likely over Jammu Kashmir and Uttarakhand with gusty winds possibility of the order of 40 to 50 kmph today and again over South Central India heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Kerala today and heavy rainfall is expected over Lachadip during the next 24 hours. If we see weather warning for 30th of May, you will see that orange color is given with, little, with the possibility of reduction in the heat wave intensity over uh, northwest and central India. Accordingly, orange color is given to Punjab, Arana, Chandigarh, Delhi, Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh, Uttar Pradesh and orange color is continue for eastern parts of the country including Bihar, Jharkhand and Odisha region and yellow color with heat wave possibility over Vidarbha and Chhattisgarh and heavy rainfall is expected over Kerala with thunderstorm possibility over these regions and uh, thunderstorm is also expected over coastal Karnataka and Lakshadweep region tomorrow. And the intensity of the rainfall will decrease on 30th over northeast India. Accordingly, heavy rainfall is expected over Arunachal Pradesh and Nagaland, Mungo, Mujam, Tupra. However, heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Assam, Meghalaya and sub and West Bengal and Sikkim region. On 31st, again, the intensity of heat wave conditions and the spread of the heat wave condition will further decrease. Accordingly, yellow color with uh, possibility of heat wave conditions at isolated, isolated locations is given for Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh, and uh, uh, western parts of Uttar Pradesh region, and uh, heat wave at few locations on 31st over Punjab and Haryana. And the thunderstorm activity with the storm activity also possibility over Rajasthan and Gujarat region on 31st and thunderstorm activity possibility over western region including Jammu Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand and Uttar Pradesh and Bihar region and thunderstorm is also expected over Jharkhand region and heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue on 31st over Assam, Meghalaya and Arunachal Pradesh and heavy rainfall over Arunachal, uh, over, uh, over Arunachal Pradesh and heavy to very heavy rainfall over uh, this Assam Meghalaya and Samuel and West Bengal Sikkim. On first, heat wave condition uh, will further reduce. Only isolated heat wave conditions burning has been given for Punjab, uh, western parts of Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh, and Bihar. And uh, thunderstorm activity will uh, commence over northwest, central, east, and south central India. And the storm activity also expected over Rajasthan on first of June and uh, heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Assam and Meghalaya region and heavy rainfall over Sikkim and uh, Arunachal Pradesh and heavy rainfall also expected over South and Karnataka, Kerala and Tamil Nadu on 1st of June and the same activity likely to continue on 2nd of June and heat wave conditions warning has not been given for 2nd of June only thunderstorm activity with the storm activity is uh, given to uh, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Punjab, Rajasthan region, with the eastern parts of Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, Jharkhand, Odisha, and uh, Chhattisgarh region, and Maharashtra, and also South Central India, where thunderstorm activity is expected. And heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over Assam, Meghalaya on 2nd of June, and heavy rainfall over Arunachal Pradesh and Sikkim. So, though more or less same situation on 1st and 2nd, with the abatement of heat wave conditions on 2nd of June from most parts of the country. So these are the present warning for next five days. We'll update again tomorrow till then. Namaskar. Jai Hind. Jai Bharat.